Yeah, the wood is sanded. It's misty out there, but it wasn't raining, so I sanded it. Yep, I have a whole day of project ahead of me. Tonight we turn the clocks forward an hour. So I left my car keys over there to remind myself to go out and set the clock in the car an hour ahead. And while I'm at it, I could look at the radio. I don't think all the speakers are working, but at least I could figure out which ones do work. But that's that can happen later. Well, the frame's kind of done here. Now I have to put this plastic on the frame. Yep. I just put the plastic on it. I'm going to trace around so that I can cut it. And then I will make little, little holes along here to screw it into the frame and it will be done. Okay, well, good enough for government work. And why is it like that, you say? Well, because of that lower part of the wall. Supposedly, it should fit right there. Let's find out. Hey, well, what do you know? It's like a shelf there. And the top. I can put my music books in there. Cool beans. That worked. And this thing, it's finished. Let's see if it fits over the computer. There's the computer on the little side table. And the cat, sometimes when he wants attention, he jumps over there and walks around on it. Here's the thing, and no, I have not tried it yet. Oh, I may have to do a little adjusting for where the cord plugs into the computer. I didn't think about that. That's pretty cool, except it is about an eighth of an inch too narrow right down in down in here. And I'll have to make room for the uh, cord. So I'll make that adjustment. Adjustment? Yes, I'll make that adjustment. Yeah. Other than that, that should work okay. Let's do make that adjustment, Cheryl. Okay, I had to trim a lot. I had to trim that and trim that so that it fit on so it fit on both sides of the keyboard. And now to put this plastic stuff on. All right. Ta-da! Finished. So when the cat decides he's going to walk across here, he's not going to bother with the work that I'm doing underneath. All right. Good job, me. <laughs> and the poor poster thing that was so big, I had cut it down. And it's big enough to be able to put something in there and hang on the wall if I want to. It's like 10 by 12 or no what is it uh, 10 by 14 something like that inches all right a little container shelf for my music books yeah 
Today I got some stuff done. How about that? Next thing, I have this little where to go. I don't know where it went. The little white truck. It's going to be the little blue truck. I think it's probably on the floor where everything else ends up. I am going to put some of that air dry foam clay on there, mold it, let it dry and paint it up, and we'll have a little blue truck. Now that's for another time. And now the worst part. Clean up and put away. Yeah. You know, I will think I'll reward myself with a beer or something. But i got to do this before it gets any later so I can vacuum and make noise cleaning. I have to remember to turn the clocks ahead before I go to bed. Turn them ahead an hour. So I'll only be one hour behind Scott in Saskatoon. They don't change their time up there. Used to be I had an hour and then I had two hours or whatever it was. I don't know. Now I'm behind because I'm in California. Oh, yeah. Tomorrow's going to be Sunday. Everybody will be here. I mean, Brian and Ash and the baby. It's supposed to be a decent day. And we'll see what happens. I do have something in mind for a future video coming up. Uh, beautification stuff like chin wax to get rid of these little hairs and a face mask and hand mask and feet mask and we'll see we'll see what happens right now I'm gonna go upward and onward <laughs>